let me show you how to add a registration form on Squarespace. So follow me to my desktop right now. Welcome to Job Form. My name is George, and today I'm going to show you how to add your job form into Squarespace. So let's get started. This is our job form panel, and we're going to get started by creating a simple form. So let's go into create a form. We can go ahead and start from scratch or use a template. In this case, we're going to start from scratch and we're going to select the classic form for this. Let's go ahead and add some elements that we might need. In this case, we're going to keep it really simple and we're going to add full name and email. You can go ahead and add the elements that you might need for your registration form. But in this case, we're going to keep it simple. Now, what do we do next? Well, let's go ahead on over to the publish section. And right here, we're going to head over to platforms. And in this case, we are going to search for Squarespace. Here it is. Let's go ahead and select this. And this is the code that we are going to need to embed it on Squarespace. So let's go ahead and copy this code. And now let's head on over to Squarespace. Now, in this case, I already have a pre-built site, but if you don't have a website, go ahead and create a brand new website. In this case, let's go ahead and work on this one. So let's go ahead and go to website. Here we go. And we have the option to go into pages. And if you want to add this in another page or go, go and add this form into another section of another page, go ahead and select it. In this case, we're going to add it to the home page. So all you have to do is just double click on this site and it's going to open up the editor. Now, when we hover over the editor, we're going to see add section in blue. Now, it's going to depend where you want to add your job form inside of this Squarespace website. So in this case, we don't want to add it here in the header. So we don't want to go here. Let's go scroll down here and we're going to add it right here. OK, so let's just go ahead and clean up this space because we want to add our form right here. Now, again, as I'm hovering over this section, we can see a button that says add block. We're going to click on that and we're going to search for code. In this section, we're going to select code and we've just added it. Now, to add our code from Jot form, we're going to click on this pencil and we have this code right here. Let's go ahead and clean this code that's what, that was there by, by default and let's copy the code that we grabbed, grabbed from Jot form. So let's go ahead and paste this here and here we go. Let's click outside and now we have our form right here. Now, if I click on this form, you can see that there's a blue square, square around it. We can resize this depending how big or small you want to make this and just place it wherever you want on the page. So you can see I move it around and I can put it on top of this, make give it another look. So in this case, it's like, a, I don't know, kind of like a 3D thing. It jumps into another one or just clean look, put it right there. It just depends how you want to do that. Now, if you want to edit our form because we changed the form, we have to again click on the pencil and add the new code that we can grab from JotForm. Now, that's one of the ways that you can add your JotForm embed on Squarespace. Now, let's just say that the form doesn't have the feel and look of your website. Well, we recommend that you work on your style and your theme so it looks more like the one that you are using on this site. So, for example, in this case, it's okay because we have a white background and the form also has a white background. But if this was embedded on a background with another color, well, I would suggest going into JotForm, going to the builder, going to the form designer and work with the color and schemes. So the page colors, form color, there's styles, there's themes available already. If you want to use this theme, for example, we can go ahead and grab this theme and put it inside of Squarespace. So again, if we like the theme that we've just selected, we'll go into publish again, go into platforms, search for Squarespace. And again, grab that code to add it over here on Squarespace. But that's how easy it is to embed our jot form inside of Squarespace. Well, don't forget to subscribe, like the video, and we'll see you on our next tutorials.